Um, I'm Mike Quinn, been an entomologist for 20 years and we're here at the Lady Bird Johnson Wildflower Center talking about what do fire ants look like. Um, they're highly variable in their size and um, Little, little red ant. Um, they're actually a little better known from their mounds, which um, about the size of a, um, a half gallon, if you will, uh, on up. And uh, so they uh, typically erect these mounds after a rain event and um, when the soil's loosened up. And um, if you put a, a stick in a mound, uh, fire ants will come up that. Another way to um, tell if you have fire ants, if one stings you and it forms a pustule, um, not something you necessarily want to uh, try out, but if, uh, if one does sting you and you see that forming, that's another way to um, identify a uh, fire ant. But we have a lot of ants um, uh, throughout North America, and so you can uh, talk to your extension agent uh, for uh, specifics on how to identify uh, and potentially uh, control them. But um, uh, a large uh, mound forming ant um, that uh, forms pustule and, and crawls up sticks. And uh, so those are some of the ways to identify a fire ant.